we're going to talk about the function called WP link pages and it accepts a parameter which is arguments which could be an array or a string and this is optional and uh, what is displays is basically the formatted output of a list uh, of pages okay so it displays the page links for paginated post includes the quick tags one or more times this tag must be within a loop okay so for example uh, let's say you have this post okay uh, that we've got and it's quite big so if we have a particular post let's say and it's quite big okay so if you check onto our site this is quite big now you do have an option that you can you know break this post into different pages and WordPress provides us with the um, option that we can go ahead and insert this set of code to go ahead and break the page okay so inserting the page breaks into WordPress uh, you know uh, couldn't be easier using this particular uh, tag okay so let's go ahead and insert that so let's say I want to break the page at this point and then at this point and just a couple more okay so let's say uh, you know and ensure that you have clicked on text when you are doing this because otherwise it won't work okay so when you should be on the text tab and then insert this set of code which is next page and the page will be broken from that point and if you update that okay so now if you check visuals you would see that the page has been breaking uh, broken from this point you can see all of the places where we have defined the uh, page break which is the next page okay then the page breaks from that point okay so all we have to do is just define that function so I'm in onto my uh, content.php okay and which is included into my um, WordPress site and I'm going ahead and calling this function at this point uh, just below the content okay uh, so and this particular content.php is within the loop okay within the uh, while have post the if have post while have post the post loop the WordPress loop okay so this uh, set of code is basically running inside of that loop okay it is not being showing over here because you know this file is being included at that point so this is the content function which is going to display the entire content uh, for that particular for each post and WP link pages is responsible for uh, you know displaying the pagination uh, links uh, for that particular post for each post in fact okay uh, which has uh, the page breaks so I'm passing the array and as you can see on codex that we have different set of arguments that we can pass so first is before so before HTML or text to prepend each link then you have after HTML or text to append each link I'll explain that to you in a moment okay so, and you have certain other parameters that you can use depending on how you would like the links to be displayed okay so I've gone ahead and passed two parameters one is before so this would be before uh, displayed before link which is the div tag and then I'm using escape HTML uh, to display pages uh, text okay and then after is the closing tag of the div okay so this function is basically going to go ahead and uh, display the pagination links for that particular post for each post in fact who, whichever has the page breaks so as you can see now the page has been broken now into five sets and this page's uh, text is coming from here so this is the div tag if you inspect element <coughs> If you inspect element, uh, this is the div tag, okay, page links. Okay, as you can see, this is the div tag page link, and this is the ending of the tag. Okay, and inside of this, we have the pages text, which is escaped and translated. Okay, so this is the pages text that's coming from here. Okay, that's here. Okay, and then you've got all of the links for the pages. So if you click on that link, it'll go into the next uh, set of page for that particular post. Okay. So you can see there are other posts which we which we don't have which don't have the uh, you know page breaks. Hence, for those we don't have this pagination. This pagination is coming on uh, from the uh, from a different function in WordPress, which is the uh, I'm sorry, which one that is paginate page, uh, paginate links. The name of that function is paginate links, uh, where this uh, this pagination is coming from. Let's see, and at the end of the 
uh, site, which is in the footer section. Well, this uh, this set of quotes over here, this is being displayed using the WP link pages function. Okay, similarly, if you had pagination for the next set of posts, then you would have had that for that as well. But because the other post doesn't have one, that is why it is not being displayed. Okay, so if you click on that, you will see the next next set of page which has been displayed from here. So, so on the second page, you should have this set of content, credos. Yep, that's what you have. If you go on the third one. Then you should have the next set of content, which is for creators. For creators, yep. So that's how it works basically. Okay, and it is extremely important that uh, this should be this function should be called within the loop. Okay, so which is the if have post uh, while have post, uh, you know, uh, the post loop of WordPress. So we have to make sure that we call this function inside of that. Okay, so a set of code is being. Uh, called within the that particular loop okay so we have this function that is displaying the pagination links and that's what it says displays page links for paginated posts includes the quick tag one or more times all right that's about it then if you have any questions you can leave the comment i'll see you in the next video thank you bye, -bye.